Hi guys, my name is Mobu Eberndo and you're welcome to another episode of What's Good in Africa this week. Please like, share, comment and do not forget to turn on the bell notification icon. On tech, again on our radar is Congo's Web3 startup Jumbo, which has raised a sum of $30 million in a Series A funding round. The funding round was led by Paradigm, Parafy Capital, Pantera Capital, amongst others. The crypto company was co-founded in 2021 by siblings Zhang James and Zhang Alice. Jumbo is a Congo-based startup building Africa's Web3 acquisition portal through a customer learn, play, and earn approach. The startup also provides its customers with easy access to crypto-based income generation opportunities. Jumbo aims to use its new funding to accelerate expansion across Africa. Still on tech, Egyptian mobile software startup Instabot has raised a whopping sum of $46 million in a Series B funding round. The funding round was led by Insight Partners, Acel Partners, Forgepoint Capital, amongst others. The mobile monitoring company was co-founded in 2014 by Omar Gab and Montas Soliman. Instabug is a software company that provides bug reporting, app performance monitoring, crash reporting, in-app charts, and user service for mobile apps. Since its launch, the software company has sat within over 2.7 billion mobile devices, processed over 110 billion mobile sessions, and helped resolve over 4.2 billion customer issues. With the new funding, Instabug aims to continue its mission of serving engineering teams with performance metrics, issue visibility, customer insight, and direct user feedback. This week on Africa Achievement, we are happy to announce yet another African success. We celebrate Cecile Jabet, who emerged winner of 2022 Wangari Matai Forest Championship Award against 59 other global competitors in Seoul, South Korea. Cecile is a Cameroonian woman who was recognized for her immense contribution to the consolidation, restoration, and sustainable management of all types of forests at various levels in Cameroon and other countries. Cecile, if you are watching this, know that we are proud of you and Africa is indeed proud to have you. Dear African youth, the future is yours for the taking. Remember, success is made up of small efforts repeated day in, day out. Consistency directed in the right path will take you to the peak. Keep at it and very soon you will be celebrated on this platform and all over the globe. On entertainment this week, the popular Fenty Beauty and Fenty Skin luxury brand owned by international music star Rihanna is set to launch its products in Africa for the first time on the 27th of May, 2022. The luxury beauty and skincare brand is said to be available in some African countries like Nigeria, South Africa, Botswana, Kenya, amongst others. If you would love to see Fenty in your country, please let us know in the comment section below. Who knows, Rihanna might be watching this video. Our product of the week is a device called Kiniku Kore. Kiniku Kore is a device that can be used to dictate smells of explosives and even cancer cells. 
The device which is the first to fuse life neurons from my cells into a silicon chip was created by a Nigerian named Osh Agabi in 2015 with a match of synthetic neurobiology and traditional silicon technology. The tech product is one that could revolutionize airport security, reduce terrorism and improve human life. We are proud that this product was first produced by an African. It, it couldn't get better than that. On tourism this week, beauty unveils in South Africa, Njani. We head to the beautiful Port Alfred, a place to unwind, celebrate, and have fun with your loved ones. Visit Port Alfred today to behold beauty and nature at its finest. Savour the amazing scenery, the culture, all are a fraction of the cost of holiday anywhere else in the world. Africa truly remains the best kept secret. Thank you for watching another episode of What's Good in Africa this week. We hope that your week would be a fruitful one. And please do not forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And also, do not forget to turn on the bell notification icon. We plead with you to share this good news with someone this week. You might just be making their week. Do have a great week. Bye.